using a 12 millimeter socket, we're gonna go ahead and remove this nut here and the one beside it. Now I can't remove these here. The head of the bolt is just too rusted off. Uh, you're gonna wanna go ahead, if you have means to, go ahead and cut the bolt. Now that we have our nuts and hardware removed from over here, let's go ahead and move forward and remove this bolt right here from this hanger. Using a 14 millimeter socket, go ahead and remove this bolt here. We're using a 14 millimeter socket on the flange bolts here. I'm not going to remove the nut on this here. I'm just going to unthread it a good portion of the way and then we'll move on to the other two. Now on the back of the car, this vehicle has two mufflers. There are hangers right here, and there's one over here. What we wanna do is get this exhaust system to uh, move a little bit towards the back of the vehicle. I'm gonna use a pair of channel locks or pliers, and I'm just gonna loosen up these bushings here. And I do this on both of these. and that should allow us to separate the exhaust in the middle of the vehicle and move this backward. Now this hanger right here that is supporting the exhaust is bolted to the transmission. There's two bolts, they're 12 millimeter. We're gonna go ahead and remove the bottom bolt and loosen the upper. This is gonna allow this bracket to have a little play to it. There we go. And I leave that bolt in there. Lift the exhaust in the center. Push that hanger back. I'm gonna go ahead and pull the front flange. Now up on the front flange right here, there should be a gasket. You wanna go ahead and remove that. Once that's removed, you want to inspect and clean the flange right here. Now we're gonna take our new gasket. Now we did go ahead and clean up the threads a little bit and put some anti-seize compound on the studs. Get our gasket up in a place. Go ahead and get these nuts started. We do have our bolt here for our hanger. We did go ahead and clean that up and put a little bit of ANC's compound on that as well. Just wanna get that started a few threads. Yep, 
At this stage, we want to go ahead and bring those two pieces of exhaust together. Prior to this here, we had moved the exhaust towards the back. We now want to move the exhaust towards the front. Just push that muffler up on that gasket and go to the other side, do the same over there. All right. Now at this point, we're gonna go ahead and snug up this upper bracket bolt here. Not gonna get it super, super tight. We still wanna get that other lower bolt in. Get that in and we'll get that started. And then we'll tighten both of these down. Let's go ahead and snug down the flange bolts up front here. up a little bit. I'm going to try and get one of our bolts started and take your bolt spring, get that put through. Just get that nut started there. Now I'm going to go ahead and use a 13 millimeter on the nut side and a 15 millimeter on the bolt side. I'm going to go ahead and snug this down. Before we snug it all the way down, we're going to go ahead and release the hanger. Now on our hanger, we can go ahead and snug this down. We're gonna go ahead and torque down these flange bolts here to 29 and a half foot pounds. 